How does sugar affect your brain? The good, the bad, and the ugly? Welcome back viewers. Research has shown, that eating excessive amounts of sugar, can be more harmful for our brains than we think. Eating too much sugar, can lead to memory deficiencies, sugar addiction, and overall health problems. The American Heart Association recommends, no more than 38 grams of added sugar per day for men, and no more than 25 grams for women per day. However, most Americans consume way more than the recommended amounts of sugar per day, as many prefer the convenience of packaged foods, and processed foods, which often are very high in sugars. Now, if you are short on time, and do not have time to watch the whole video, then just click the timestamp topic in the description that you are interested in. Otherwise, keep watching for some really fantastic info. Now, here's some trivia for you, the brain needs sugar as a fuel source to function properly. So, what are the best types of sugars for the brain? We will give you the answer at the end of the video. If you like our info so far, then please like, share, subscribe, and hit that bell to stay informed. Now, the brain uses energy in the form of a simple sugar called glucose, to fuel cellular activities. So, the brain must have some type of sugar source to function properly, as it uses 20% of the calories, that we burn each day. However, a diet, that is high in sugar, can lead to excess glucose in the brain, and studies have linked excess glucose consumption to issues with memory, and cognitive deficiencies. Another reason that sugar is harmful to the brain, is because it affects certain neurotransmitters in the brain, which can result in being addicted to sugar. One neurotransmitter in the brain is dopamine, and some of the processes that dopamine controls include, learning, behavior, mood, and memory. Parkinson's disease, Alzheimer's disease, and drug addictions, are some of the more extreme conditions, associated with disrupted levels of dopamine. As mentioned before, disrupted dopamine levels, can also cause the brain to become addicted to sugar, as the brain becomes used to having to deal with higher levels of sugar. In fact, the dopamine receptors can be altered in certain areas of the brain, from consuming excessive amounts of sugar over long periods of time. The effect that sugar has on dopamine, and the dopamine receptors, is what makes it addictive, and this addiction is what makes it so difficult to eliminate sugar from our diets. Not only is too much sugar harmful to the health of the brain, but it is also harmful to our overall body health. Too much sugar can lead to oral health problems, in the form of tooth decay and cavities. In addition to this, too much sugar can also lead to excessive weight gain, and thus, increases the chance of developing type 2 diabetes. Insulin is a hormone that helps the body to metabolize sugar. But, if there is excessive sugar in the body, then an insulin resistance can occur. Eventually, this insulin resistance may lead to type 2 diabetes. Ultimately, to keep your brain healthy, you should consume sugar in moderation, and within the recommended consumption guidelines. Always use wisdom when adjusting your diet concerning the effect of sugar, on the functioning of the brain. And, if needed, talk to your doctor about any specific health issues that you may have regarding how your brain is functioning. Now, here's your trivia answer, according to one research study. The best sugars for the brain are complex carbohydrates, or what your grandmother used to call, starches. Starches and fruit sugars, that is, fructose, do not cause the roller coaster mood swings, that the refined sugars do. The molecules in complex carbs are long. Therefore, it takes longer for the intestines to break them down into the simple sugar, that the body can use. Thus, this type of sugar, provides a time-release source of steady energy, rather than a sudden surge, that is then followed by a sudden drop. If this video has helped you, then share a comment about it below. And also, share it with your friends. Thanks for watching, and check out some of our other great health and fitness videos shown here. And, remember to like, subscribe, and hit that bell. Thanks again.